And it's going to be a power-packed Sunday for the Indian Space Agency, ISRO. The agency will be performing its second launch mission for the year 2023. While the first launch of the year was ISRO's smallest rocket this weekend, the country's largest indigenously built rocket, the LVM-3, will be lifting off. And our correspondent, Siddharth Emp, who has been tracking the story very closely for us, has sent us this report about the significance of this launch for India's space program. Take a look. Built by the Indian Space Agency, ISRO. It's called the Geosynchronous Satellite Launch Vehicle Mark III, or LVM-3. It stands 44 meters tall and weighs 643 tons at liftoff. The rocket has an amazing track record. It's delivered successes in all its five launches to date. Until last year, the rocket was used only for select purposes. This includes launching India's high-profile national missions, such as Chandrayaan-2, and placing heavy satellites to orbit 36,000 kilometers above the Earth's surface. In October 2022, that changed. The LVM-3 flew a commercial mission for the first time. In a commercial mission, a customer who wants a satellite delivered to space selects the rocket they want and pays the launching agency. It is just like hailing a ride. But this ride to space costs millions of dollars. UK-based telecom firm OneWeb has signed up with ISRO's commercial arm for two launches. This was an agreement to launch 72 satellite in batches of 36 each. It would bring in more than a thousand crore rupees or $125 million in revenue for India. OneWeb is piecing together a constellation of more than 600 satellites. So far, OneWeb has done 17 launches and the one that's happening in India this weekend is the final launch. The 18th launch mission for OneWeb. After Sunday's launch, OneWeb would have more than 600 satellites in low Earth orbit, roughly 400 kilometers above the Earth's surface. These satellites will then beam down internet connectivity across the globe. With Sunday's launch, OneWeb's service would go live at a commercial level. By the end of the year, the company hopes to roll out worldwide services, including in India. ISRO has moved the vehicle to the launch pad and all seems set for Sunday's big launch. So, 9 a.m. Indian time, 26th March, Sunday, it is. The launch of India's heaviest rocket, LVM-3, is an extremely rare occurrence. Over the last nine years, the LVM-3 has flown five times and, of course, in five missions, it's delivered all successes. However, this is soon set to change. In October 2022, LVM-3 flew its first commercial mission and now it's set for its second commercial mission, which is happening on 26 March, the end of this week, that is Sunday. However, LVM-3 will not just stop with that. LVM-3 will be carrying out Chandrayaan-3, India's lunar landing attempt and third lunar mission by August 2023. And later, LVM-3 will also fly multiple times by end of 2023 or early 2024 as part of the Gaganyaan human spaceflight program. This goes on to show how ISRO has scaled up capacity to build LVM-3 and also has serious aspirations by going commercial with LVM-3. From Chennai, Siddharth MP, we on World is One. Vion is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.